Hi, how are you? My name is Rosie, in case you still don't know me. In this video, we're going to be talking about e.l.f. Bite Size Eyeshadow Cream and Sugar and Truffles. So we're going to be doing two things. One, we're going to see how the colors work. And number two, we're going to apply them using a TikTok trend just to see how well that works. And I'm doing this video thanks to Suhani Sharma. She always leaves me nice comments. And this is what she says. Hey Rosie, can you please do an eyeshadow tutorial on e.l.f. Bite Size Eyeshadow Palettes? I just bought it and was planning to buy some more because they're awesome and inexpensive. It would be of great help. Lots of love from me to you. Thank you so much. So because of you, I went to the store, bought them, and they are only $3. That's an amazing price for each palette. So I can't wait. And if you're still not following me on all social media accounts, you can find me everywhere with the same name, Lynn Sire. So without talking anymore, let's begin. <laughs> Oops, <laughs> I just kicked the tripod. <laughs> My bad. So before I start using these eyeshadow palettes, I'm going to swatch them to see how the colors are. So here you can see the colors. I love these type of colors that are like earth tones. They're neutral colors. They're so easy to create different makeup looks. So here you can see it. I'm a little scared of the black. I don't usually play with black eyeshadows. Then this one here, which is this one, doesn't show too much. It looks really light. And then the gold tone, I really like it. It's really noticeable. So on this side, I'm going to be using the Bite Size Eyeshadow in Cream and Sugar. And on this side, I'm going to be using Truffles. This is the TikTok user that I found and she's showing three colors, one, two, three. And then all she does is blended we're going to be doing that and by coincidence these colors are really similar i don't know why i'm nervous let's hope it comes out good so what do you think if we use this one this one and this one let's try it out so i just noticed that for each color she uses a different q-tip Wait a minute, she did a line from the top to the bottom. Now let's go for this color. Wait a minute, but she only did one motion each time. It seems like she really feels the cute with a lot of color. I feel like I have to do it a few times because if not, I feel like I'm not getting enough color. This color is really pigmented. Oh, <laughs> this one, yeah, I can see it. So here you can appreciate it a little closer. This is the brush that I'm going to be using to start blending. Moment of truth. So she doesn't blend it by little parts. She blends the whole thing together. Okay. Okay. So for me, it blended as one color. Like I don't see the three different colors. So there's two things that I'm thinking. Either one, I didn't do it correctly, or number two, the colors are not like, too pigmented to follow this TikTok trend. I'm going to try applying the colors one more time. So 
So this time what I did, as you can see, I applied more of each color. Now I can see it more. But this time, instead of blending everything together, I blended it like in the middle of each color. Honestly, I like how it looks. Which, by the way, if you still don't follow me on Instagram, do it right now at Linsire because over there you will be the first to see what I share here on YouTube. On Instagram stories, I recorded these behind the scenes for this video. You will also see me try new products and more. So if you don't follow me there, do it right now at Linsire so you can find out about everything before everyone else here on YouTube. So moving on, we're going to try truffles on this side of my eye and we're going to try a similar technique, but this time she starts applying each shadow with a Q-tip without blending, like without using a brush. Now that I think about it, it's really similar to what I just did on the other side. So on this side, we're going to use the gold tone, the brown shade and the black one. I think I have to apply a little more. Now let's put on the brown shade. I feel like this looks messy. So I feel like I have to blend it. If not, it, it just looks weird. So there it is. What do you think? Hmm. Let me apply a little more. So there it is. What do you think? Which one do you like more? So there's two things to talk yeah. about. One, about the colors. I think they're beautiful. I think they are so wearable, like for day-to-day -day makeup, like if you're going to work. You can also get a dramatic look from these colors. As far as the TikTok trend, in my personal opinion, I wouldn't use the Q-tip method. I, I found it a little difficult to blend the colors. Um, I would just stick, I don't know about you, but I would just stick to using makeup brushes. I don't think I'll be using the Q-tip again. So let me know which color did you like the most? Would you try this TikTok trend where you use Q-tips to apply eyeshadow? Let me know in the comments section. And when I finished following these TikTok makeup trends, I recorded this Instagram story at Linsire. If you don't follow me on Instagram, you probably missed the moment when I finished doing my makeup in real time and I put in a survey to know which makeup look I should pick. Most said the left side and with those colors, we are going to finish this makeup look to go out.
So let me know what you think. Do you like cream sugar or truffles the most? I personally like both. I have such a hard time picking just one or the other. Would you try this TikTok trend? Let me know. And anything you want to see in the comment section or if you just want to say hi to me, you can do so in the comment section. As always, everything that we have used in this video is going to be in the description box. And don't forget you can follow me on all social media accounts with the same name, Lynn Sire. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Kisses! Bye. <laughs> Hi, Gugu. -goo. I'm filming. By the way, I'm not hungry. I just ate. Oh, what did you eat? Frozen Yummy. Do you want something else? Oh, you can take it. The container's in the fridge. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so here you can appreciate it a little closer. Are you actually saying that right now? Yes. Sorry, I thought that was from your phone. I mean, your computer. No. I have like a whole little studio in here. What do you think? It's good. You wanna come? To you wanna come say hi to the camera? You should add that in the video only like apart from it. <laughs> okay. I think I will. Just saying. Hi, mommy. Hi, I know I need my close up glasses. Thank okay. you. Alright. Thank you for your services. Goodbye. Okay, maybe. I'm oh, yeah, and I need my tablet just in case if my phone dies. Okay. Oh, yeah, and I need your phone, I think. Mm -hmm.